Hi guys, in this video I will show you how to prove the Pythagorean theorem in the simplest possible way. So, to prove this Pythagorean theorem, which is a squared plus b squared equals c squared, where a, b and c are sides of a right triangle. So, our objective is to derive a relation that will relate two sides of right triangle to the third side. So, to do this, um, A squared here represents like a square, area of a square with a side A and same for B squared and C squared. So, this tells us that we need to deal with squares. So, to start out, I'm going to draw two squares. So this is, let's say, our A, and this is B. And I'm going to put B here, and this A. And then this is B, and this is A, and this is B, and this is A. And then I'm going to draw the same thing here. A, B, A, B, A, B, A, B. So, here if we connect these two, it's A, B and the, this is a square, so angle is always 90 degrees. So if we connect these two, this will be C. This is also A and B, so connecting these two will give us C. This is also A and B, so connecting these two will also give us C. And this is also A and B, connecting these two will give us C. So, since these two squares have the same side, A plus B, they must have the same area. So, the area of this square is A plus B squared. And the area of this square is, is also A plus B squared. But we can write the area of this square in another way using C and these four triangles. So the area of this square is going to be C squared, which is this area, and then plus four times the area of the triangles. Each triangle is same because all of them are ABC. So the area of each triangle is one half AB. And this these two are equal because these two squares are the same so if we equate a plus b squared is equal to this now we can simplify this so this will become a squared plus 2ab plus b squared is equal to c squared plus this becomes 2ab so we can cancel out 2ab and we get a squared plus b squared equals c squared so Pythagorean theorem is proven.